In problem 1.114, 1 we're giving a bunch of exam scores for students, and it told us that normally our exam scores for this exam are normally distributed with a mean of 70 and a standard deviation of 10. Now, first thing I do when I'm doing a problem is I write down what they told me. So they told me my mean is 100, my standard deviation equals 10, and they did also tell me that it's normal. Okay, and part A, you take all the students' exam scores and you standardize them all. Okay. Part B, someone had a question on part B. Part B says, if a grading policy is only to give A's for the top 15%, what would be the cutoff for an A? And it says, in terms of a standardized score, which means find Z. The cutoff for Z. So you say, okay, I draw my picture. We're looking for the top 15%. And we're looking for the C value. Now you can't look this up on the table you, because that's the area to the right. We want the area to the left. So let's do 1 minus 0.15 and that's going to give me 0.85. So I'm going to look up 0.85 area to the left on my normal table. Now areas are in the middle, so look in the middle for 0.85. So it looks like this one's pretty close. This Z equals 1.04. Now, if you were to use a calculator, you'll get a better answer, a slightly more precise one. And if you'd chosen to use z equals 1.03, your answer will still be close enough. Okay. So z is our cutoff. So if any students have a z-score higher than 1.04, they'll get an A in the class. So again, for all of your students, you already found all of their z-scores, so if anyone has a z-score higher than 1.04, then they will get an A in the class.